Today, I would like to talk to you about what is known as complex Riemannian manifolds. These are actually distinct from what is conventionally known as complex manifolds in several different ways. They are a lot more similar to normal real manifolds you would find in general relativity than um, complex manifolds. Before I get to them, I, you're all familiar with the wave equation, I would assume. Like imagine you take a rock and you throw it into a pond and you can see how the waves ripple outwards from that. That's essentially how the wave equation works, where the system evolves over time. And so when we normally think about it, we think of it as like having a real value defined everywhere for real coordinates. This like acts exactly as how we expect it would. You could take some like real function, which actually you take a meromorphic function, I should say, that like you can plug in like ct and x as like two um, coordinates. You could make it such that on like for real, real values, it's it, like gives a real result and it abides by the wave equation essentially. You could then take that meromorphic function and start plugging in complex values. When you do this, like it's still like a perfectly well-defined system, but now instead of getting like real values out, you're getting like complex values out. 